Hey everybody, my name is Rahul and in this video we'll be talking about a new cybersecurity project which is called predicting malicious URLs using machine learning. We all have been witnessing this wave of machine learning and AI. So why not leverage that to kind of create a new project. Now I'm particularly focused towards offensive security. So I did not think that this would be of particular use to me. I haven't created this project but I have all the resources you need that you can leverage to kind of create this project. So what is this project about? Now what this project is about detecting a malicious URL from a non-malicious URL using machine learning. Now how do we do that? So what do we do is we collect two sets of data. The first one is a list of safe URLs and the second one is a list of unsafe URLs. As you can see the first one is unsafe, the second one is safe. Now we collect data and lots of it and then we feed it into a machine learning algorithm and based on certain factors we can kind of guess that a new URL that we pass to it would be either a malicious one or a non-malicious one. So let's see what do you need. First of all you need data and lots of it. That data would be comprising of two sets. The first one would contain safe URLs, the second would contain unsafe URLs. The second thing is that you need an algorithm to analyze the data. What I'll be doing here is, since I did not create this project, I'm referring a Medium article. A big shout out to Faizan Ahmed who created this article. Uh, this is quite old. So the data that I'm going to reference will, would also be quite old. But you can do the homework and get new and updated data. First of all, what he did was gather data, then perform analysis. To perform analysis, he has used logistic regression which is kind of a supervised learning algorithm. Now in AI, broadly speaking, there are two types of algorithms. One is supervised and the second is unsupervised. Now this falls under the category of supervised classification algorithm, wherein the goal is to classify the data that you have into different classes. Now, once you have classified the data into different classes, for example, safe and unsafe URLs, the next URL that you pass while testing it and based on the data and the parameters that you have set in, the algorithm would kind of tell you if the URL is safe or not. Now, as you can see, the code is all in here. Vedan has also linked his GitHub repository that you can use. If you go to F security, you might not find this article because the domain no longer exists. But I can assure you that the same article that this has is right over here, which is, which is in medium. You can also use Wayback URL to kind of revisit this article. Uh, just to give you a brief glance of the test data that Fezan used, as you can see, it has a lot of IP addresses, as you can see this, which are prone to be malicious in nature, uh, hosting bad domains. So how do you get good data? So I think the data containing good URLs is already in the data.csv file, but for malicious URLs, what you can do is you can use threat intelligence tools to kind of get or fetch all the domains that are known to contain malicious payloads. So I hope this was of some use to you.